been a crazy, crazy month, had it, the whole month of January. Okay. I am ready for this weather to go away. However, the, this is Groundhog Day, too. And what happened this morning? Six more weeks. <laughs> now, just a reminder for everybody, you know, if the schools are closed because of weather, we are closed, too. Young people and old people ain't got no business being out on the snow and ice, okay? So just remember that fact, okay? But I do want to welcome you to our February birthday party for all of our members who actually have birthdays in February. And we're honored today to have our chairperson here, Dr. Ramona Jackson Jones. Good morning, everyone. And happy birthday. I love February. Valentine's. And I see, I see some hearts on the table. Uh, thank you all so much. Uh, we really appreciate the seniors here in Douglas County. And I thought a good morning America approach is fun because you have an opportunity to tell us who you are, where you're from, as we celebrate your birthday. And then you have an opportunity to watch yourself on television monthly. So this has turned out to be great. This is the second month of the year. And so far, so good. I see a lot of babies born in February. So this is your month, and thank you for what you do in Douglas County. And I personally appreciate the, the dues that you have paid to society. And every moment I get a chance to celebrate you, I will. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We are so proud of the commissioners and from uh, Dr. Jones here, because they do support us. They do support the Woody Fight Senior Center. They do support the seniors in Douglas County. So we, we welcome her today, and we're glad to have her here. We also have here Melanie Arnold from Visiting Nurses back here. She will be calling bingo in a little while, okay? <laughs> and she has some prizes. Okay, but however, only the birthday people can actually win a prize. So everybody can play, but if you're a birthday person and you got that little bag in front of you, then, then you'll be awarded a prize. So uh, we're glad to have her, and we, we so appreciate them supporting us, but we have a lot of our community people, community vendors, who through the years for different events are so good to support the Witty Fight Senior Center. So we, we were glad of that. Now, let's move on to who you are. You don't have to tell your age, but you can if you want to, okay? But I want to find out where people are born. Normally, we have somebody, we have an international crew. We didn't think we were going to have one last month, but we did wind we up did. with one. So when I'm coming around, I want to know your name, if you want to give me your age, and where you were born, okay? So we're ready to get started here. Don Crosby, Pahokee, Florida. Okay, so we got a Florida person here. All right, happy birthday. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Jim Trapp, I was born in Columbus, uh, Wisconsin. Okay. Happy birthday. Thank you. Columbus, Wisconsin. Yeah. I'm Lane Blair, 66 years old soon, and um, I was born in Atlanta, one of the few natives. Okay, right. so, so an Atlanta person here. Grady Very Baby, or where, where were you born? What hospital there? Uh, Crawford Long. Crawford Long. Crawford Long Hospital. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> I am Louise Grady. I was born in Sandersville, Georgia. I'm a proud 66-year-old. Very good. Happy birthday. And I know Happy exactly birthday. where Sandersville is. I used to live in Milledgeville. So. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. Let me get around over here on the other side. All right, ma'am. I'm Mary Liz Grant, and I was born in Columbus only because that was the nearest hospital to Phoenix City, Alabama, where I live. <laughs> okay, so she lived in Alabama, but she was born in Georgia, so that's okay. All right. Well, happy birthday. Very good. Very good. Uh, I am Antoinette DeCruz. I was born in Anniston, Alabama. 
I live most of my life in Bridgeport, Connecticut, and I feel like the old timer listening to the ages. I'll be 83 on wow. February 24th. Oh, praise the oh, Lord. Lord. Thank you, dear. Yes, 83. You. How 83. about that? Happy okay. birthday. So you were born in Alabama, but you spent most of your life up there in the as north, a, right? As a youngster, about 9 and 10, I moved to Bridgeport, Connecticut, and that's where I've been. Came here in December of 2016 for Christmas, and I'm still here. Very oh. good. Okay. <laughs> My name's William Joseph, and I'm born in Haiti. But there I we go. Oh, international. Right. <laughs> international. Give us your yeah. name again. William Joseph. Okay. Yeah. Okie doke. Very yeah. good. I won uh, February 22nd. February 22nd. How long have you been in Douglasville? Oh, 12 years. 12 years? Okay. All right. All right. Very good. We're going to move over here. All right. I'm Bessie Smith. I was, I'm from uh, Memphis, Tennessee, and I've been here since 1989. And I'm 66. All right. Happy 60. birthday. We got a lot of from my hometown, 66. Memphis, Tennessee. That was That's a prolific I'm month, was it not? Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. My name is Ruth Million, and I was born in Guatemala City. Oh, another international. <laughs> oh, yes. right. We have Haiti and Guatemala. Yes, ma'am. Okay, very good. Well, happy birthday. Thank happy you. birthday. My name is Connie Tria. I was born in Dayton, Ohio. And the 28th will be my 80th birthday. Oh, very All good. Right. 80. Happy 80. birthday. So, I'm sure we had some more folks that signed up for our birthday party today. However, a lot of people right now have the flu. I've known several of our members who have the flu. So, we're hoping that that gets over pretty quickly. But I'm Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear, bless you. Happy birthday to you and many more. Happy birthday, everybody. Happy birthday. Thank you all so much for coming.